Hello Disciples, Donkey here, and today we'll be going over the patch notes that Bungie just released recently. There's a lot to cover, and I highly recommend you read the full set of notes. The link is in the description, but for now, I want to highlight a few hot topics in there. The first being the customization coming to Lightfall, specifically the loadouts menu. They say that each character will have up to 10 loadouts that you can fully customize from guns, mods, perks, and even subclass abilities. It will all be available on one screen similar to the current drip customization screen where you can adjust all of your shaders and ornaments at once. We can see some examples of those menus here. We will also have the opportunity to share our builds with friends and other members of the community similar to how you would share links in the DIM online. The next big change is happening to the mods and it's definitely my favorite. All mods associated with energy types like Arc and Void will have the energy type removed and will become common mods that you can equip on any piece of armor. This will allow for a lot of creativity when it comes to making the best builds across all of your characters. And there will be some nasty combos to be made, I'm sure of it. Currently, all mods are unlocked for everyone in the game, but once Lightfall drops, they will implement a new Guardian ranks system where you'll have to be at least level 6 to have access to all of the mods. And Bungie will go into more detail about that in the future. They go on to say that the artifact mods are being translated to unlockable perks and that they will no longer need to be socketed, but rather unlocked for the duration of the season once earned and are passively applied to your loadout. That is a really big change because now you don't need to take up those additional mod slots on your armor to have those benefits. Bungie also says that you'll be able to have up to 12 artifact mods active at the same time but not all the mods because that would be too OP and broken. So that's a really good change. Match game is being removed. Thank you, Bungie. And they are increasing damage to shields with non-matching damage type to 50%. Champions will also be a little bit easier to kill as they will add in new ways to stun those enemies with things like Jolt, Volatile, and Blind. And lastly, Elemental Wells will be getting new names with their associated subclass. Ionic Traces, Zark, Fire Sprite, Solar, Void Breaches for Void, and Shards for Stasis will stay the same. Strand will also have an element once it gets released in Lightfall. Well, that should do it for this video, quick and to the point. I hope you all enjoyed it, and we will see you Guardians in the next one. Oh, and P.S. Yes, Retrofit Escapade got nerfed. Sad day. <laughs>